According to the report, conducted by the St. Louis County Medical Examiner, Michael Brown sustained a gunshot wound to the top of his head. The bullet was then lodged in the soft tissue of the right side of his face. There was also an entrance gunshot wound to his central forehead, and the bullet exited through his right jaw. Another bullet went through Brown's upper right chest and was lodged near the soft tissue of space between the ribs on his right side. Brown's lateral right chest was also hit. The bullet was found in the soft tissue of his lateral right back. A gunshot entrance wound and a graze wound were found in Brown's upper right arm and right bicep, respectively. Another gunshot entrance wound was found in his right forearm. A shot also grazed Brown's right thumb and wrist. Dr. Julie Melanek, a San Francisco-based forensics pathologist, said the examination backed up the theory that Brown was reaching for the gun if Brown is found to have gunpowder particulate material in the wound.